Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm doing comfy and casual summer outfits because I don't know about you, but sometimes towards the end of the season, I do kind of like run out of outfit ideas. So I did kind of hop on Pinterest and look for some inspiration. But um, yeah, if you're interested in seeing what I put together, then stay tuned because we're just gonna jump right in. All right, let me um, include my dogs. They haven't been in the last couple of videos just because usually they're sleeping when, <laughs> when I'm filming. So I haven't had them in, in here, but today it's, more, it's later in the afternoon for me and they are up. They're in a very playful mood, as you can see. So yeah, I thought I'd just let them say hi. I know you guys like to see them once in a while. Alright, so first outfit that I put together is one that I'm really, really loving. It's just this kind of cool toned outfit. And now that I've played with them, they're going to be super noisy. But I just have on this basic gray tank top. I did get it from Group by Babaton at Aritzia. Um, and then I paired it with these uh, a goldie, I think these are the long Parker shorts. And I have them in a size 24. And then I did also throw on this light blue overshirt um, or button down. It's very, I've washed it and it's very uh, wrinkly. It's super, super wrinkly. Um, you definitely need to have like an actual you need to have an actual iron to get the um, wrinkles out because I tried to use a steamer. Definitely was not good enough. But I just rolled up the sleeves and I would probably wear these with, I've got these um, sneakers right here. These are the Nike Dunks, the low Dunks I think, in Nature Sale I want to say. That's probably what I would pair with this outfit for a very casual, comfortable look. All right, next outfit is very comfy and casual. It's like almost just loungewear <laughs> that I would wear out. Um, but it's this oversized graphic shirt, t-shirt that I got from Abercrombie and their shirts are just so soft. Like I love the, their, their um, graphic tees. So I did get this one. It's kind of got this like French film festival con uh, graphic on it. And then I paired it with these dark navy blue bike shorts from TNA at Aritzia. And yeah, this is definitely something that I <laughs> would be caught wearing out and about. I don't know, maybe this is a little bit too casual, but just to run to like the post office or quickly run to the grocery store, I love wearing things like this because it's just so me. And I'd probably wear them with Birkenstocks too. <laughs> okay, so another favorite of mine have been these um, corduroy pants. So, I got, these are like the brown Empire, and I don't, I'm not crazy about the logos because they're just these like bright green, like patch and also like embroidering or like a iron on sticker thing. And you can't really take that part off. So I'm not totally crazy about that, but I really, really love the fit of these because they're giving me, it's just skater girl vibes. I don't know if you guys can see Tucker's in the way. <laughs> Um, but yeah, this is totally giving me skater girl vibes and these pants are just so comfortable and the pockets, like I can just put my, Tanner's going a little nuts with his toy right now. He loves to do this thing where he like thrashes the toy from side to side and it's literally like hitting him on both sides of his head and I'm like thinking that's gotta be, that's gotta hurt, <laughs> but that's what he likes to do. Anyway, I love this outfit. The top is from Zara. I don't think they have this anymore, but I really, really love this color. It's just a very, like, similar color to 
that flax beige color that they have at Aritzia that I'm obsessed with. So yeah, this is the next outfit. And I think I would probably wear like either my Air Force Ones or like the Nike Dunks or one of those, or even like Birkenstocks with these, with this outfit. I wear Birkenstocks with everything. <laughs> All right, so next up, I've got this kind of like contrasty outfit. I'd probably wear this with me, my black chucks. I have my black chucks right here. I thought, I think that would look super cute with this outfit. But I'm just wearing um, these cargo pants from Brandy Melville. I thrifted them, so I don't think they're in, they're um, available anymore. But I'm sure there's something very similar on the website. And then I have this super super inexpensive top from Zara. And the reason why I love this top so much is one, the price was like so good. I think it was under seven bucks. And um, it looks like a tube top from far away, especially if I have my hair in front. But it has like these really tiny spaghetti straps because usually I don't like wearing tube tops. Like I think they're super cute, like I have some, but I just find that a lot of times they're like always falling down and you know, you're always fidgeting with them and stuff like that. So I really like this super stretchy, like comfortable top from Zara because it kind of gives you the tube top look but it has some straps. So yeah, this is the next outfit. All right, so up next, I've got this cute little outfit on. This top is from Maritzia. I haven't worn it yet, but it is the affinity top in light birch. I have it in a size small, and I did go ahead and like unbutton the last buttons so that it kind of I wasn't loving the way that this top was laying on me, um, like on my torso when it, they were fully buttoned. It just kind of like bunched up in a weird way. So I unbuttoned it and I think it looks a lot better. And then I did go ahead and pair it with these low rise jeans from EB Denim. These are one of my newer additions um, to my jean collection, my denim collection. And I have to say, I'm absolutely loving them. If you're a low rise girl, these jeans are, are like amazing like I just I think they're so flattering and they are a little bit long on me I did just cuff them at the bottom but I do like the bagginess and like the oversized look of the jeans so if you don't then you can just always like get them tailored but if you're on the shorter side but because yeah if you were if I had like a couple inches on me these jeans would be totally perfect but I'm only around 5'4", so yeah, they are a little bit long on me. But yeah, this is another very comfy, casual summer outfit that I would wear all the time, and I would probably Hi. just pair this. That's Tucker. I would probably just pair this with Hi. sneakers, like white sneakers. All right, so I think white denim is just such a summery look. So this is the next outfit. I am wearing the contour tank top from Aritzia. I think this is in the color matte pearl. And I'm pretty sure I have it in either an extra small or a small. Um, the straps are adjustable, which is really, really nice because I feel like mine are a little long, so I should actually adjust them to be shorter. And then I paired them with these A Goldie Lana jeans. I don't know what color, like what wash these are in, but I freaking love these jeans. They're so cute. And they're just a nice clean pair of denim in the sense that they um, don't have any distressing on them. And they're a straight leg. My dogs are in the way, again. <laughs> They are straight legs, so they just really elongate the body, and I really like that. So, and then for shoes, I would probably, again, just wear, like, a sneaker, like, a white sneaker, or even, like, brown socks, again. <laughs> I wear the same shoes all the time, which is probably why I never really show full outfits in my videos, because I'm not, like, a huge shoe and bag girl I'm more into clothes so, all right calm down so yeah anyway this is the next outfit I'm totally loving it and jeans and a tank top oh, bless you jeans and a tank top is definitely something that you would see me wearing all the time so another 
all white or like all cream outfit but like I said I do feel like white jeans or white denim in the summer is just so on trend and like summery every summer it's like just a thing so I am wearing the same top from the last outfit um the spaghetti strap and then I did pair it with these a goldie Parker shorts and I have to say I really really love these shorts like these are so comfortable like if you don't own these like I really think that you should give them a try <laughs> I love these shorts and I think what's really nice about them too is that they kind of have like a slightly darker ever so slightly darker stitching so it's I like that little detail about them and then um I did throw on this corduroy like overshirt or jacket I don't know what you would call it jacket um and yeah this one's from nasty gal I wear it all the time and yeah this is the next outfit all right guys so this is the last outfit I kept on the same shorts the Parker shorts from the last outfit um and then I did change up the top I just put on this like sage green uh, tank from Aritzia. I can't remember the name of it though. I'm so sorry. And then I did want to also show this jacket off because I think it's so cute. Let me do a close up. So it's got this embroidery of like hummingbirds and flowers, which I just think is so beautiful. I got this off of the seven for all mankind website apparently they did like a collab or i don't know if you would call it a collab but they did like a collection inspired by bridgerton and i ended up falling in love with so many of the pieces i was able to grab this on sale hopefully it's still on the website because i think it's so adorable if you know if you are more on the girlier side and you love denim jackets and this this is like a really cute way to do a denim jacket with a girly twist on it so yeah I just wanted to show this really quick I love it and I do feel like it goes even though it's got like a lot of stuff going on I do feel like it goes with a lot of outfits that um, I've tried so far but anyway thank you so much for watching this video and give me a thumbs up if you liked this video and I will see you guys in the next one bye